Hello friends, this is Miss Sudi and welcome to Reading with Miss Sudi. The book I have for you today is titled How to Grow a Friend. It's written and illustrated by Sarah Gillingham. Making a friend takes patience, care and room to bloom, just like a flower. Let's get started with ways to grow a friend. Please read with me till the end and press the like button if you like it or dislike button if you do not like it. And let me know by commenting um, as to what you liked or what you didn't like. Um, and then please go ahead and subscribe to my channel. On that note, let's get started. How to Grow a Friend by Sarah Ginningham. To grow a friend, first, plant a seed in good soil. A friend needs water, warm sunshine, and space to bloom. To grow a friend, talk and listen. It doesn't happen overnight. Sometimes a friend bugs you. To grow a friend, chase the bugs away together. And don't let your friend get stuck in the weeds. If a friend is drooping, do something sweet. Good friends stand by each other in rain or shine. Good friends make things brighter. To grow a garden of friends, remember that new buds can sprout in surprising places. And there is always room for one more. And that's a beautiful garden of friends. And that's the end. This lovely metaphorical read teaches valuable lessons in how to treat others and make friendship blossom. Making a friend takes patience, care, and room to bloom, just like growing a flower. Soon, your little gardeners will have their very own green thumbs for their most important of life skills. Loved sharing this smartly composed read with you. See you next week. Love you all.